Uh, Mayetta joining us now. I think this, there's no such thing as good fishing weather. Let's just find out if there's good weather just in general, as, Rob. Yeah, as long as the seas aren't at 20 to 30 feet and there's not too much wind, every day's a nice day to be out on the water. Today, we're kind of seeing a little bit of that around the coast uh, before stormy weather returns big time as we get into Monday. Right now, 66 degrees in San Jose. A few breaks of uh, cloud cover there, allowing for some blue skies. 62 in Walnut Creek right now, and I think we're going to see about the same temperatures around tomorrow with low 60s currently in Dublin and San Francisco, mostly cloudy skies and uh, west northwest wind at 12 miles per hour. Now what we have out there if the clouds is sort of the weakened end of a storm system here that is just passing by the Bay Area. You can see here a few isolated showers along the coast. Slight chance of showers in the North Bay tonight, but really the main event that we'll be talking about is arriving for Monday nights into Tuesday. Bigger change tomorrow morning. The time again, we rewind the clocks back an hour tonight. Sunrise now changes back to 642 in the morning. We'll have a chilly start 30s and 40s outside as our skies clear and during the afternoon, partly cloudy skies. Sunset time will now be at 505 and there you see the temperatures to wrap up your weekend. 65 degrees in San Jose, 62 around San Francisco and Oakland. A similar spread of temperatures from north to south tomorrow and it should be very nice. Out at Santa Clara, kickoff time, 49ers, Cardinals will have some mid 60s, so no rain and no gusty wind. Nothing like we had a couple weekends ago if the stormy conditions, temperatures staying in the 60s around kickoff time and then dropping into the upper 50s around the fourth quarter. Now notice here as we head into Monday, another atmospheric river pattern setting up, but not as strong and not lasting as long as the event we saw about two weeks ago, but it will power up some pretty good rain rates at times, especially Monday night into Tuesday. That's the reason why the North Bay average right now looks like around 11 o'clock Monday night to about 5 a.m. on Tuesday should be about one to two inches of rain and the rest of the Bay Area picking up about a half inch to three quarters of an inch of rain. So for Monday, Monday morning looks fine. As you see, mostly cloudy skies by the afternoon we begin to see light rain and then the main impact coming in for around 11 o'clock Monday night and you saw those rain totals even as the storm moves out on Tuesday morning. You may see some ponding on the roads. It's enough rain that that could linger into the Tuesday morning commute. Then after that, the storm starts to move out pretty quickly, which is the reason why even though we have an atmospheric river, those totals look like they're going to stay in that one to two inch range and notice the timestamp there on the upper right portion of the screen. Skies clearing and that might be it in terms of storms. Once we get past Tuesday, long range outlook as we get into it looks like November 17th starting to trend a little drier and you're going to see that transition now in the seven day forecast as we wrap up the weekend with cool temperatures, wind and rain increasing Monday evening into Tuesday. Then the rest of the week around San Francisco trending drier and a bit warmer. So it's been a while since the seven day forecast really focuses on just one storm. <laughs> it's a powerful one, though. It's really going to get your attention if the wind and rain Monday night into Tuesday. But after that, things do dry out as we head into next weekend. Good news, though. Those rain rates, they'll be heavy at times, but shouldn't cause as widespread the problems we had two weeks ago. Of course, we all obviously need the rain and see our snow around here as well. Right, thanks very much. Yeah. yeah.